Welcome back, my niggas. It's your boy King Lawrence here to make y'all days a little less boring. Coming at y'all niggas with another the GTA, the Lost and Down playthrough, nigga. This is this the this is the first episode, but like how can I say, nigga? Yeah, just, just, just sit back, kick, kick, sit back, kick your feet. You know what I'm saying? Just, just like the show, nigga. Shit, I don't know what the fuck to say, nigga. I just woke up. I'm sorry, I just woke up. Let's yeah, see. Yeah, this is this is my favorite DLC. I really like Johnny Clippin's story, nigga. Oh, uh, it's it's real fucked up. What happened to that group? Let's see. <laughs> Hold on, little buddy. Come on, guys. Come on, let's go. Let's go. Keep it up. I'm gonna push you down these stairs. Yeah, Come on, watch out. Watch out. I got a man in a chair. All right, everybody, come on. Break it up. Let's go. I really fucked with this intro too. I ain't gonna lie to you. I mean. The GTA 4 intro is actually pretty good, but this is, I like how they all stood. Nah, just, just watch this shit, bro. Just watch this shit. That theme song and everything, bro. Damn, she's kind of bad, though. Doo -doo, doo -doo. Oh, shit, nigga. Oh, Billy. You understand what probation means? Uh, yes, sir. It means that if you continue down that same path, you'll be locked up and calling some cellmate daddy within a month. Yes, sir. If I had it my way, we wouldn't waste our time. You'll be inside already. Mr. Gray has made great progress. His share on willfulness was one of the most powerful things I've ever heard. I, I believe in this man. Well, let's hope you don't live to regret that faith. God works in mysterious ways. <laughs> in this case, seems God is downright perverse. But I'll leave the salvation to you, gentlemen. You stay out of trouble. Yes, Daddy. Excuse me? Yes, sir. Billy, remember, it's a disease. I know, Chad, I know. It's a disease. Meetings every day. Call you if I feel the need to use. Pray. I pray. In fact, I'm praying right now. You're very willful. Was very willful, Chad. Was very willful. I've changed. And you know what, Chad? You changed me. Gentlemen, shall we get the fuck out of here? Hey, stay in touch. Yo. Here you go. It's about time. Home sweet home. <laughs> Let's get the fuck. 
fuck out of here! Back to the house, boys! Oh, Only oh, Billy no. Gray would get taken down on a distribution beef and end up in a country club. How were things in there? You know, John Boy, it was kind of hard. Harder than you think. I don't know what I'd rather go back to. Stents in the hall or group share cluster fucks in that place. Okay. Whether it's train gangs in the showers or grown men crying and hugging in rehab, there's definitely an undeniable twinge of homosexuality in this fine country's correctional system. No wonder you keep getting caught then, Billy. You can't stay away from it. <laughs> now, let's be clear. I keep getting caught because assholes like you ain't watching out for me. Don't question me. Sometimes you gotta look out for yourself, Billy. Okay, I'll save my questions until I see the chapter. And you better have looked after my baby. Johnny, what's going on? Not much, Bill. Usual stuff. We missed you, Bill. So, aching for a fucking drink here? Amiguito. Come on, just pour a Willie wet back. Boys, salute wet you pussy motherfuckers. And right to salute. <laughs> okay, oh, another round for you. Everyone. Goddamn right. <sighs> mm, yummy. So, Johnny boy, where's my bike? You know where it is. Let me rephrase the question. Where the fuck is my bike and where the fuck haven't you got it back for me? Because you know where it is. Are you deaf? Give me that whiskey. Are you fucking deaf? No. Then answer the goddamn question. Why the fuck haven't you got it back for me, friend brother? One word. Business. Like I told you when you were in there. Or were you so busy playing holier than thou, you started believing your own bullshit? Oh, forgive me. You know, I've had a complicated few weeks. I can only imagine, though. Shut up, Brian. You know, coming off heroin's kind of hard. I think I acquired this touch of amnesia. What business is more important, Mr. 1980s yuppie big shot, than your best friend's bike when he's close to getting a 15-year stretch? The business that pays his lawyer's fees. Hey, hey, the business that puts food on all of our tables. The business that we are all in while you're out pretending to be saved. Get my bike! What am I, your fucking dog? I told you you should've gotten the bike. You told me? You told me you don't tell me shit, you little fuck! Listen, Billy. They were pissed, and they had a reason. Your bike chopped that girl's leg off. You put Joe John's nephew in a coma. The deadbeats kept the bike, and we needed the money. You needed some balls. Ugh. Some fucking heart. Something. Can't believe I'm hearing this shit. Yeah. And I can't believe I'm hearing this. After everything we did for you. Paid your rehab, paid your lawyer's fees, paid your rent, paid everything. Shit, we set stuff up for you. We do well, man, but it's time to be smart. You're right, you're right. No, you're right. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to run right out and buy a condo, get a mortgage, 401k, and then fold that over into an IRA and a CD. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck, man? Be smart? You be smart, you fucking chump. You're ridiculous. Have you got a health care plan? Come on, Johnny, let's just get his bike. Come on. Well, on your head be it. It always is. It's called leadership. Shit meaning something. Yeah, and your shit means a lot, man. Come on. Hey, Johnny. Yeah? Wait, come here. Listen, man. I'm a little pin up right now. You saw that shit I had to go through, right? It was really frustrating, fucked up shit, craziness, right? Okay, so I'm a little pissed off and I've been a bit of a prick lately. But come on, man. You and Angus built that bike for me? That's got to stand for something. Yeah, you're right, brother. I'm gonna go get it. And you know what? Peace and prosperity be damned. Peace and prosperity be damned, my brother. You are my brother, Johnny. Always. Let's go! You want something done right, you do it yourself! 
brothers aren't meant to be this close, Johnny, but we're gonna have to be until I get my bike back. That guy with the barnyard might know where the bike is. He's over on Guantanamo. Good to see you too, tough guys. Uh, what bike are you talking about exactly? You know what we're talking about? Billy's bike. Billy's bike? <laughs> Jesus, man. It's been a long time. I thought he was dead. What's he wanted for? To sell for crack, right? Hey? Shut up. Listen, you know how it is. Things passed hands. Parts been changed up. Hard to say if that chopper's even around anymore. Sorry, boys. You will be, my friend. You will be. Hey! G good to see you, Bill. Man, I, I thought you was dead. Jim, start up the bike. Whoa! Hold on! No. Wait! Please! Please! No! 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 no. Where is my ah, bike? Ah, Speak, no, you no, ugly no, fuck! No. Okay, listen. Uh, the Angels of Death took it to that place in Northwood. What the fuck? The Angels of Death! Uh, thank you! <laughs> yes. Thank you! Keep business afloat or we're fucked. 
You just don't get it, do you? This is what it's about. This. Not that money shit. We're in it to stick it to all those yuppies and hippies and motherfucking deadbeats. Give me a stiff drink, some hard drugs, the wrong matcha, but that's all I need. Maybe an occasional bit of a hole. Wouldn't be a man if I didn't need that, now would I? How's Ashley, by the way? She's single? What about your brothers, man? Ain't you in it for the lost? Everything I do is about the lost. I don't exist without my brothers, without you. If you don't get that, then you don't get nothing, John Boy. Is that state of affairs? Yeah, well, it's some tough love you're showing them. Down, boys. I mean, Johnny was kind of getting soft. Uh, Watch it! That. I can see that. Johnny was kind of getting soft. I don't think you'd be soft enough to let that shit that happen that you take fall happen. So I'm, I'm just saying. I'm just saying. We're here! Come on! Oh, Let's geez. get your fucking bike! your bike. Take what you gotta take, drink what you gotta drink, fuck what you gotta fuck. I don't care. Kill who you gotta kill, but get it out of your system. Hmm. And when you do, give me a call and we'll get back to business. You're not my P.O., brother. Remember who the head of this chapter is. I do, man. Trust me. Tell me. 
Do you still have Ashley's phone number? Why don't you give her a call for me? Tell her I'm inside getting all sorts of fucked up, and that I would really like I mean, we, meaning all of us, would love some whole. First job when they said punch the clock? I really did. I didn't last there too long. Yeah, okay. It's like I got psychic powers or something. Nothing but and bellyaches with you guys. I know. Did you get a manicure? You should be saving your strength for your arm, man, bro. Those deadbeats are a pain in the ass. What's new, Johnny? Right My old man Razor is twice the man you are. Uh huh. I I never tried to get a girlfriend. I want to know if the other two can hit him in there because I never really tried to. See, I think uh, GTA 5 should have stayed like. I mean, I, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I, don't know. Uh, I might crack your wrist. See, if they die, they would be replaced with a little bit of lost game. Let's see. Little dorky gas station attendant boy goes, hey, man. Are you all right? And I go, yeah, dude, how's my bike? <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey, Johnny K. Hey, Johnny, how you doing, baby? Hey, Johnny, come on down. Hey, having fun over there? Absolutely. And if I get tested, I have a bag of 12 year old piss right here. I am clean. Real nice. Oh, fuck you, Johnny. You don't judge me. Whoa, calm down, man. Have another drink or something, but calm the fuck down. Oh, hey, fuck watch your you, mouth. Faggot. Tell yeah. him. Oh, really? Whoa, 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 whoa. Guys, guys, Billy, hey, Johnny. Like you got a couple of fucking deadbeats outside. Fucking what fucking deadbeats? What the hell are they doing dead? here? What the Let's fuck, fuck do they want? I'm out of rehab three minutes and they think they can crash yeah, my party? Yeah. Come on! Yeah, come on. Yeah, yeah, yeah let's go! We gotta do. Gentlemen, gentlemen! Why the long faces? Might I tempt you in a swift libation, my most trusted and honored guest? I thought we had a truce going on. Did you? Funny thing, I wasn't aware. But let me tell you, it's a strange kind of truce that makes you think that it's okay to gate crash my party? Deadbeat, motherfucker. I'm sorry. Huh. You enjoy your little party. I take it the good times are over. No problem, old man. Screw you, you deadbeat prick! Yeah, think you can come to my you. party and gate crash? Come on! Yeah, come on! Ah, uh, you moron. That nigga 
Billy Lewis fucking up a lot of shit that my boy put in place. Let's though. get those angels with that, Johnny. That's the thing, though. Johnny was about his money, but you know he's a chick, so that makes a lot of sense. He's keeping niggas alive. Thank yeah, God. money coming through. That's bad craftsmanship. These boys are going straight back to their chapter, brothers. Sorry about that. Seen this hot Russian broad over on Firefly Island? Gonna drink a daddy's expensive vodka and fuck her under the pier. <laughs> Ooh, young love in the modern world. Yeah, that's beautiful. Well, these dead beats won't be screwing around with us anymore. Let the good times roll. Okay, that's it, child. I love you. I need to thank y'all for supporting. Thank y'all for watching. I'll see y'all tomorrow.